come along on one of the most exciting scuba dives we've done on live yet. This was the kind of morning that put us in a dive high for the rest of the day. We headed out to Black Rock at sunrise on the west side of Maui, Hawaii, and it's a quick glimpse, but it was so cool to catch this hunting Hawaiian water snake. Not really a snake, it is an eel, like this white mouth moray, who curiously peeked out of his hidey hole to get a look at us. I know it looks scary, but you can take a look at this moray's mouth and see where its name comes from. This is not an aggressive display. The moray's open mouth is actually pumping oxygen over its gills. Out over the sand channel, I noticed this bait ball of minnows and thought it would be a fantastic photo opportunity. And surprise, we were so excited to see this hunting shark, which we do think is a gray shark, but let us know what you think. It could also be a Galapagos. Look how quickly the shark blends in and disappears from view. These top predators are gorgeously built for the ocean. Just because I have to say it at some point, the Humunumu Uku Uku Apua'a, the Hawaiian state fish, we really love to dive at sunrise, hoping to see some of the ocean's top predators. But another reason we make it out into the ocean so early is the absolutely incredible lighting. There's just something magical about a sea turtle, or honu, heading up to greet the sunrise. Here was a first for me, getting a glimpse of the critically endangered, endemic Hawaiian monk seal. There are around 1,500 of these seals left in the world, and only around 400 of them hang out around the main Hawaiian island chain. This seal was extremely curious, and I did my best to keep my distance. We do want to try and stay at least 100 feet away. And, like any predator, these amazing creatures demand respect to not only keep them safe, but ourselves as well. All in all, an incredible experience that I can check off my bucket list. It's crazy to think that because we were live streaming this dive, thousands of people got to have these moments with us. And it really just adds to our fun while we're diving. While we're streaming, I can see your comments and I do my best to answer as many of your questions as I can. But as you can see, writing down answers to everything isn't always that easy. And yes, I'm the crazy diver who doesn't wear her hair up or wear a wetsuit. Thankfully, the water's pretty warm at a balmy 80 degrees. But that wraps up one of the best underwater mornings I've had in my life. Mahalo and we'll see you on our next dive.